All right, so this is part C of the ripple effect, the Earth and Space Science new mandated lab. All right, so we got a scale. We got a real fancy one. You can use a more basic one, I believe, for this. Uh, we got some uh, vinegar. We also got some uh, distilled water. Okay, and we got the cups labeled distilled water vinegar, so we'll mix them up. I got some Tums tablets. And uh, we're ready to see some weathering. Let's see the weathering rates. Let's see how fast. All right, let's see. All right, so we're going to find the initial masses of two tablets, one that's going to be put into the tap water, which rec represents normal water, one that's gonna go into the vinegar, which is gonna represent the uh, acid rain, okay? Which uh, is when water uh, in the air can mix with carbon dioxide and create a weak acid, a carbonic acid, H2CO3. Okay, let's find our mass of our first tablet that we're going to utilize. And our mass is, what's the mass? 2.6 grams. 2.6 grams, please record it. Oh, wait. Oh, Record in your data table. Okay, 2.6. 2.6. Okay. okay. Okay, let's now remove this off. Remove the tablet and put this right here. This is the one that's going to go in the tap. Okay. And let's find the mass of the second. So there may be a differentiation. Up, 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 up. Hold on. i got to reset the calibrate. Oh, yeah. All right, scale recalibrated. Second tablet. Bombs away. 2.6. Wow. So Tums has been on their ball game here. They've measured them out. They're both the same mass. Excellent. Okay. Excellent. No tariff on the Tums. Yay. All right. We are now going to put the tablets into the uh, acid rain or the vinegar and the water. Um, and it's, it gives us the direction for five minutes. We're going to time that. So we're going to drop them in at the same time. I have equal volumes of vinegar and water in both of the cups. And we're... Uh, we're ready to go. All right. Okay. Here we go. Make sure they're in. Uh, oh. Chemical reactions. All right. I'm not going to spoil the the show for anybody who's now going to do this themselves. So I'll see you in a bit. I hear bubbling. All right. So we're about halfway through. What do you see in there? What's the difference between the two? One is pink and one is very much clear. Nothing is happening with the distilled water. Where is there more weathering happening? The vinegar or acid rain. Yep. Looks like a nice, it's a nice I was thinking of the word cavern. Cavern. That could be being formed in the ground. In the limestone bedrock of the Allegheny Plateau. Just some notes. Um, while you're waiting and doing the investigation, there is the fourth column observations. I would probably suggest you fill that out, everyone, while you're watching. Thank you. All right, so the time is up. I'm gonna first take out, very carefully, if you have a pair of tongs, I would recommend it. I'm going now to take out the tablet that has been in the regular water. Water, obviously, is known as a universal solvent. So it, it'll, do, it'll, do, it'll do some work. It'll, it'll eat away. It'll get dissolved just about anything. But over time, right? Earth's 4.5 billion years old, so it's had a lot of time to do its work. Okay. Well, I'm back on the scale now with it. Okay. Oh, wow. Well, it's still 2. It's 6. still measuring at 2.6. Let's record that. Excellent. 2.6. Excellent. Okay. I'm now going to remove the tablet. From the tray here. Let's try to get all the residue off. I'm going to try to give this a little cleanup job here. I'm going to restart the scale. Make sure there's nothing on here. I'm not going to use the tear function on this, but we'll just go like that. Let's see if we got back to zero. Let's reset you. Hey, thank you. Okay, now I'm hoping there's something left in here. I've got to try to fish it out if anything's left in there. If there's something in there, I feel it. I just can't see it. If you can get the white thumbs up, I feel it. I just can't get it out there. There it is. I got it. I'm almost feeling like this is like, I'm, I'm hearing the word paz in my head. Paz, not, not the Spanish, but paz, P-A-A-S, the Easter. When you make the Easter, uh... oh boy, look at that. Oh, it went down point. 
It went down. How much? Oh, wait, no, it was, oh. Did it go down a full gram? Up, oh, look, look, look. 1.5. Yeah. Uh, oh! Oh, because it's still dissolving. <laughs> it's still... <laughs> it's still going! It's still weathering. Can you say that? Yeah. It's still what? It's still going bye-bye. Can so, you say weathering? Weathering. <laughs> no, bye-bye. All right, bye-bye. <laughs>